Hola, mi amigos! We are back in the wildlands of Bolivia playing covert ops of a kind here in Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. I am, as always, your host, Mighty Mr. Mustache, the mightiest mustache in the universe. And I can't believe that this is episode 21. I'm having a great time. And we have taken down four bosses so far. We're working on our fifth. And we're going to go out and kick some butt. As always, like, share, subscribe, do all that good stuff. And if there are aspects of this game that you want to see more of, less of, different loadouts, things like that, you are free to let me know in the comments. I am at your service, my friends. We're going after the story mission. Yeah, El Cerebro. We're going to go try to capture the brain. The brains behind those crazy, wacky submarines. <laughs> Looney Dad Bird on patrol. Yes, I will watch it. Okay. Thank okay. you for warning me. Uh, let's go grab a car because it's a kilometer and a half to get there. So we'll grab us a vehicle. But as you can see, at least on the basic difficulty, you don't need to have um, any of the crazier special oh, cool. weapons let's that move. show up later on. Um, you can just do it with the starting weapons like I'm doing. Sometimes it, I think it's more quality of life to be able to summon in a helicopter whenever you want or um, uh, an armed vehicle with, uh, whatchamacallit there, get out of my way, uh, <laughs> an armed vehicle with a minigun on top of it. That, those are fun and they definitely make some of the missions easier, uh, but any time that I've messed up these missions and failed and had to start again, mostly it was because I wasn't paying attention or... I was just horsing around for the for the video or um, you know I wasn't playing it quite as stealthy as I could have or, you know having some of the higher end abilities may have helped but I don't think that it's a hundred percent necessary from what we've seen so far uh, maybe when I get into the, the, the rank 5 difficulty stuff and, and really have to take on huge amounts of uni dad better weapons and better um, better diversionary tactics from the rebels might be useful and maybe I'll go back and do some of the side missions in order to unlock those things but for now I'm having a good time um, I think the sheer amount of gameplay that's involved means I should be trying my best just to get through the story here and, and show you guys how it plays so we are on the edge of this uh, of the zone where we need to go in and capture LSA Rebro try saying that one five times fast and we're going to go in and see if we can catch the little pump up butt. Drone. Uh, they have That's a, a jammer. The drone's being jammed. They have a drone jammer, which means I'm going to have to use the binoculars. Alarm over which, here. There's an alarm on the tower. I there's a couple of bad boys up there. Hands. Okay. Should be able to drop that guy. Go. Definitely going to take out the alarm on that tower. I'm definitely going to try and drop a couple of those guys. I'm going to mark one of them. Roger. Let me get in position. I'm going to mark both position. of them, actually. And then I'll see if I can hit marked. this guy. Shit, I'm going to mark all three. Position. The heck with it. That's Save what the... Word. There. Pop, goodbye, all three dead. Now, I will take out the alarm tower at 150 meters at basically a straight shot. I can't believe I missed. Okay, no, straight shot. Boy, that hardly drops at all. That sink shot ability, as you can see, really is the bee's knees man it's the bee's knees it's the wasp's nipples it is the erotic it is the erogenous zone of every major insect in north america and uh it's absolutely the way to get this thing done if we can find the ja the drone jammer um that'll be amazing because then we can just drone mark every damn thing in it in this compound in in literally seconds heads up we got a turret we have a turret, but nobody manning it. We have a tower. Sniper in the tower. With a sniper in it. Oh, 
Oh no, way. That's like twice I seem to have hit a the immune to everything railing. And then I You're kidding me, right? This guy Oh, I hate that. The worst part. Right in the face. Got him. Let's see if I can drop this guy. Goodbye. So I'm taking fire now. Oh, they threw a grenade at me. You bastardos, you. Okay, so I totally screwed the pooch trying to shoot that sniper and missing when I hit with the invincible um, block of wood in front of him. It seems to have blocked every piece of... Um, every bullet. And now I'm being shot from every direction and I have no idea where they are. So down I go. Okay. Uh, I'll let this guy heal me and then I'll see if we can get in and do it. I don't know why the alarm's going off when I destroy the alarm tower. Um, definitely made a mistake doing this. Damn, that was Mistakes close. were made. I immediately regret this decision. Let's get some cover here. Watch for the bad guys coming in. And uh, I just, I could not see where I was being shot from. Chop Even though I can see them over, uh, over there somewhere. Let's get... Oh, there they are. Haha, -ha, I see you now. That came from the bridge. Where is that? Oh, I'm gonna get killed. There's nothing I can do. They just came from out of nowhere. This mission, obviously, the big thing is to find the power, find the thing, and don't shoot that sniper unless I have a good clean shot at him. I cannot believe I hit that. Uh, <laughs> I have a good... My, my daughter's showing me something very strange on the side here. Sorry, I laughed. Uh, I can't believe I hit um, that railing crossbar. It's the only thing in the way, like twice in a row there, and just completely put us on the spot. I should have used six shots to take him down, I guess. Anyway, we will try again, because why not? We will pull up our vehicle, because I forgot we have it. And I need to remember, I can use a diversion, so deploying some rebels. I can request backup of rebels. I could have dropped mortars on them, I but I guess I was hoping for... Um, I guess I was hoping for things to run a bit better. Uh, I heard a vehicle drop in. I'm looking over where it went. Uh, excuse me. Where is my vehicle? Y you heard... Uh, everybody on my comment section, you heard that vehicle drop in, right? I heard an... Er, click, click. And it told me a vehicle was there. And apparently, that doesn't matter. Because it's nowhere on the map. And it usually does show up and gives you a little indicator. Shit. Oh, well. I'll just go into here where these people are and steal one of theirs. Because nothing says covert ops like stealing cars from people who will notice that you've stolen their car. And who apparently two minutes later don't care. Anyway, these are all bad guys. They're all... Uh, Sicarios and uh, cocaleros and uh, all those hot words that they keep using in the game. So I'm allowed to kill them by the multitude body count of thousands. Get back before they make you. Come on, hop over the railing. Drop that guy like a sack of bricks, man. Just spotted one with submachine guns. All right, great. I think I just dropped two with two shots. Like I went over his shoulder, killed him, and then tracked into that first one. That was pretty hot, man. I'll tell you. Got him and got him good. I'm trying not to laugh because every time I say something remotely funny, my daughter's sitting over here and she gives me this look like, please, Dad, must you? <laughs> apparently, my, apparently my Spanish accent is not working. I just sound like an idiot. Which, you know, isn't necessarily a bad thing either since it's just for fun on a video.
A break into my best teach Marin impersonation, man. Are engaging. Where the hell did they come from? <laughs> I'm gonna get so much hate mail for that, I'm telling you. <laughs> People in the comments are like, you racist bastard, you. What the heck is wrong with you, man? Drive through the thing in my little Volkswagen bus. They're actually a lot of fun to drive. And here we are. Okay, we're just on the edge of the search area to capture El Cerebro. The brains of the operation, quite literally. And this time we'll try not to screw the pooch. And um, we'll get in here and see what we can do. I don't see anything on the on the map that indicates and if you do play on harder difficulties those That's glowing awesome. areas that indicate potential enemies yeah those don't those just disappear you don't have them anymore okay, there's one bad the guy I got a target another bad guy one of these this time if I take the ah oh, this time I can take that guy out so easily it's gonna be good let's get crouched so we have no, oh yeah. You notice when I bought that stability upgrade for the sniper weapon, just how nice it is. Got him, got him before he realized. Nice. Okay, we're still good. First shot missed, because I let it I drop a little bit. Here. Okay, there's a generator there, which means I can take out the power. That helps, because that will stop alarms from going off as well. Speaking of alarms going off. That one's broken. The alarm is disabled. I see a second target. Dropped him like a sack of bricks. Got another tango. Uh oh, his buddy came upstairs. They've been alerted. I'm moving to position. Target marked. And drop him. That tank goes down. He knows he's being shot at, but doesn't know where from. That's always handy. Drop Power's the power. Down. See, taking them out from this distance is handy because they kind of don't know that I'm a, there yet. Oh, looks like I have incoming. That was fucking close. Yeah. They're on alert. Not anymore, they're not. Ha <laughs> ha. That was really nice to drop those vehicles, but good. Then him. I wonder if dropping the power Is means... <gasps> oh yeah, I, that means I took out the... the jammer, the drone jammer, and that means I am available to just scan the area. Any way that I like. There's one guy in here, and he's just hanging around in here somewhere, and I can't spot him. He's inside of that building, I think. Okay, so I can get across. Stealth swim. <laughs> Just means dive under the water and hope he doesn't see you. The fact that I can apparently hold my breath for about 20 minutes there. So I'm not just a special forces, I'm a special forces who's also an orca. <laughs> okay, we seem to have taken out the majority of the bad boys here. Or all of them by the looks of it. So let's start, well, at least all of them in the immediate area. So let's, um, let's get someplace where we can get some cover. Grenade. What the heck? Where'd that fire come from? It never said I was being spotted. Oh my, that was no fun. Aha, there they are. Fire, fire, fire. Uh, 
Okay, I shot him four or five times now at point blank range. How is he not dead? That is weird. Okay, boys, get your job done. Take, take these guys out. Good, good, good. Now. Aha. There is a guy over there. I just saw him. Did we kill him? No, he's hiding. I marked him. Oh, he's still marked. Being colorblind doesn't help. Gotcha. You, my friend, are dead. That boy blowed up real good. There's a rainstorm on its way. I don't know if that'll help us or not. But we seem to have dropped all of the bad boys. Oh, somebody over there. Drop that one. Grenade, move. Grenade, move, move, move. Got one. Did we drop that guy over there? Yeah, it looks like they got him. Okay. Now, oh, I see somebody in the zone running across the bridge. Yeah, there he is. Show your face, show your face, show your face. There you go, right in the guts. Actually, I think I shot him in the nuts, but you know, it'll do. Guts, nuts, whatever. Somewhere in the lower body that he was not happy with. Being sniped at from way across the map. You know, I can play that game too, buddy. Oh ho ho, pushed him into cover. Yeah, you better duck. I keep driving him under cover. I need to get a cleaner shot at him as soon as he pops up. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. I'm opening fire. Hey, you better be opening fire. What are you doing over there, buddy? Seriously, hiding in the bushes? You're supposed to be a covert ops maniac, just like me. Alright, let's make our way across that bridge. I think, over here. I think this is the direction that we should be moving in. You go and find El Cerebro. We've been here before. I know we came in and blew up that uh, that submarine, which is funny because Bolivia is a landlocked country, and apparently they sail their submarines down tributaries of the Amazon River, <laughs> over waterfalls and through rapids and out to the ocean, so they can smuggle coke into Mexico. Seems like an awful lot of work to smuggle in a couple of hundred pounds of cocaine. I mean, there's so many other easy ways. How about just bribing officials and stuff? But literally, they made these mini-subs, these 30-foot-long mini-subs that, you know, find their way down through the Amazon River all the way to the ocean and then go around either to Florida or Mexico. Yeah. I, I just carried across the border to Peru and sent it from there. I don't know. It just seems like work, work for nothing. Okay, so we're still looking for uh, El Cerebro inside of this round uh, area. I don't know if he's right in the middle or not, or if that's just <clears throat> an indication of where the mission is. And we're still supposed to be searching. We don't want to kill him, we know that. We seem to have killed every um, punk, I guess. Sicario. 
bad guy, except for <coughs> the brains of the operation, El Cerebro, which I believe is what that means. But then again, you'd be surprised at what I believe. We'll leave um, the markers so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. Yes, in the meantime, we'll be stealing supplies. I won't make that a supplies joke again, though. No. Um, let's see. Uh, so we wander around here, tree houses, um, odd sort of things and areas. Let's come up here. What do we got? Enemy we got activity nearby. Oh, enemy activity nearby. Maybe, maybe this is what we're looking for. Let's uh, scope it out. Ah, here we go. This looks like the place. Sniper in the tower. Sniper in the tower. Bad the guy tower. over there. This definitely looks like the place to be. It's hot, it's happening, it's got an alarm on the tower. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna say I appear to have oh with the power off I no longer have to take that no longer have to take that thing down though. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Okay, let's make our way up here. We Yo, take, cartel gunman. Inside the firing post. We will take the dude out in the tower for Soitens. Soitenly. Come on, show your face. Come on, you know you want to. What kind of a sniper doesn't show his face so I can shoot him? Come on, buddy. Stick your face out. Nah. Can't kill any of the others until I get the sniper because... Oh, there's... Hang on, there's a guy right there. And another one. And another one. Over there somewhere. Okay. I'm not going to drop either of these guys just yet because somebody is bound to notice. What I will do when I get the opportunity is take out the sniper. As long as you stay crouched or even prone, they have a very hard time seeing you even if it's like painfully obvious that they should. And uh, you can upgrade your skills to the point where they won't see you. Um, when you're prone, almost if, even if they're almost right on top of you. And there's another one. Okay, let's Moving mark these three. Let me get a good sight line. Oh, there's a fourth. Target marked. Oh wow, the building is full of these guys. I need a better position. Target acquired. Stay by. Okay, I'm gonna wait. Okay, good. Let's, 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 this, let's let this cool down, and then as these guys come back, we'll drop them as they come out. I don't think it's going to be too big a deal. Got it, moving. That one. Get the fuck down. We're late, we're late. Take you so much fire. Okay, that's okay. He'll bring me up and then we'll get to some cover. We did pretty well, actually. We took a lot of the bad guys out. And it doesn't look like uh, El Cerebro was going to try and run away. This is a, this is a long mission because we need to find our way around. Enemy down. Uh, even if though they know we're here, we are making a good wraparound. And they're not in a position to... Summon in reinforcements, or we should be okay this way. They're coming right for us. I'm kind of okay with them coming right for us. 
I have a, a little angle of the ground here, the ground cover. And I can drop these guys. Still love using uh, semi-automatic fire over full auto. Contact near the stack of tires. There we go. See, don't move away from your cover. That's that's a big thing. Forgot, I can do that. I can also do that with the drone. drone I didn't up. realize that I could call in a drone strike with a mortar shot. I'll call the rebels Look at that. Fight. That's amazing. This guy's never going to know what hit him. Bye. <laughs> Sucks to be you, dude. Alright, and then we have bad guys over here. I saw one just running into that building. There he is, coming around the drone jammer. Which no longer works because we shut off the power. Gotcha. Behind us we seem to have some trouble. Got uh, unfriendlies over there. Hold up. There he goes. There goes the little boy. We're supposed to grab, not little boy, but the Elsa Ribro. We are supposed to grab. Easy, come in. Then. And I can do that as well. I forgot that I could kill people while still pushing this guy along. I'm going to take him and drop him in a helicopter. There we go. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. All right, we kill all the bad guys, and we snagged El Cerebro, and now we're gonna pitch him into a helicopter and fly him off to the rebels for questioning. We'll even take this really big one. Stow him in. In you go, buddy. <laughs> Drive helicopter. Sure, why not? Drive it, fly it, you know. A little from column A, a little from column B. This one's got lots of guns, so if you were doing this with a team of your buddies, they could each man a gun. And you can even have your own. Later on, they have Apache style helicopters that have missile launchers. I prefer you didn't. But I've almost cracked it. You know how cold it is underwater? The issue of chemical binding? Not an issue. It ought to be easy to find monoethanolamine in Bolivia, right? It's just an issue of scale. Can I call Lydia Flores? She's probably busy, but she won't mind. She knows me. We're close. What am I talking? Probably? No, no, no. I mean, it's probably needs to compartment. Wouldn't leave room for any people. That's so. I want suspects for a Colombian submersible that just had a breathing tube sticking out of the surface of the water. Imagine the heat signature. I don't call media till I have a real solution. Did I mention I know her? Do you know her? Haven't yet had the pleasure. Wait oh, this guy I'm is like, you know, the rain man of Colombian drug cartel building. 
<laughs> no idea, pal. We're at the rally point. I'll take him from here. Thank you, baby Jesus. I'm sick of listening to this guy. <laughs> yeah, me too. Actually, I'm not sick of listening to him. I think he's adorable. But we've captured him. Uh, looks like we've taken down the fifth zone. Issued uh, So episode 21, we've taken down five of the areas. I think I'm going to try and do them all. I don't know if you have to. I know you have to take down two of the lieutenants in order to uh, in order to bring out El Sueño and get the ending. Now I have to take him over to the door. Sorry I landed the helicopter on top of your building there, boys. But that's just the way it goes. Uh, let's see if I can get to the door. Extract, here we are. Get a little cutscene, and then we'll call it a video. Ma'am, Mitty will be looking for me. Good, because we're looking for her. They say you've got a good brain between those ears, camarada. Now that you're up Shit's Creek without a submersible, you may have figured out that you need me to help you, and I will, once you help me. Huh. Forgive me for asking, but what do you think this is? Compelling? Dramatic? The rocks here have been around for centuries, long before you were a gamut in your father's testicle. And be around long after you've gone back to the dust. Do you understand? These rocks have more significance in the universe than you do. And your high and your hypocritical war on rocks. Hmm. Are you taking me to Nivea or are we waiting for her? Do you not understand that I will lock you up in prison? Where tattooed neo Nazis will use you as a human pincushion for their dicks? <laughs> the problem is that you still think that anything matters. Anal rape, cocaine, murder. It's all nonsense. Do you think the jaguars waste any concern on how they feel? Or that the rabbits they eat contemplate the name of God? Meanwhile, you're still lying to yourself, convincing yourself that you make a difference. So nothing matters to you, El Cerebro. El Cerebro? I am not El Cerebro. El Cerebro slipped through your fingers before you even knew he was there. He is quite simply gone, as though he never existed. Well, all right. El Cerebro took off, and we got some nutjob weirdo talking about how the rocks are centuries <laughs> old and matter way? more than us, it's and like evil rape in prison does apparently it doesn't bother him. <laughs> he led us on a wild goose chase while he bugged out. <laughs> Man, who the fuck is Bowman talking to? El Cerebro's top Experimental number 42 lamp, as Damn, a weapon. that's some next-level supervillain shit right there. Either way, we put the cartel's submarine fleet out of business. It could take years to get that program running again. And El Cerebro? The trail's cold for now. Bowman will keep her ear to the ground in case he resurfaces, but we're moving on. So did we finish this area? Let's take a look. Yes, there we go. We finished that area. Uh, let's take a look at our new named weapon here, the Experimental. Oh, there's also an El Baston. What's El Baston? Oh, it's a light machine gun. Okay, I'm not a light machine gun fan in this game. Uh, experimental number 42, however, is a... Oh, that's, oh, it's a Sten gun. Oh, that's so cute. It's a British Sten gun. It's neat. Check this out, man. Air-cooled front side-mounted magazine. Tape-wrapped grip. Oh, it's got a little wooden front stock. Oh, look at that. It's a, it's a World War II commandos gun. The British used these. It was the, the cheapest, most $5 put together hunk of junk submachine gun you could ever make. Terribly prone to jamming, but the British commandos used these all over it. It was called the Sten, S-T-E-N. Wow, I'm not sure why it's considered an experiment. Maybe it's, uh, he decided to copy and see if he could throw one together for the, uh, uh, for the Cicadios to build and use cheap. But it's pretty neat. Uh, I won't use it <laughs> because it's loud. It can't be silenced by the looks of it. Um, but yeah, that's kind of neat. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to call the video here. Thank you for coming along on 21 full episodes of this. I will catch you next time. Uh, I have been Mighty Mr. Mustache, the mightiest mustache in the universe. I'm going to go try and be a good dad and hang out with my daughter for a while and do uh, fun dad-daughter stuff. As always, I wish you a great day and some great gaming. Catch you next time.